account of interview from the headquarters here in downtown Philadelphia, the Honorable Bishop S.C. Johnson, the world's foremost minister, Bible analyst, and a party on the department. <laughs> Church of the Lord Jesus Christ of the apostolic faith. We're located in downtown Philadelphia at 22nd Bainbridge Street. We're glad again to come to you by the way of radio that you might know that you might understand there is only one way for everybody it wasn't left to man to choose his religion this is not like buying shoes or suits amen this is one thing that has been ordained for the human family. One name. One gospel. Amen. One gospel. Amen. For who? For the human family. One gospel for everybody. One gospel. Not uh, many gospels, like men have it, but one gospel. That's the same thing for everybody. Jesus said, many false prophets, many false prophets. The 24th chapter of Matthew's 10th verse says, and then shall many be offended, shall betray one another, and shall hate one another. And many, many false prophets shall rise, and shall deceive many. That's the truth. Many false prophets shall arise and shall deceive many. So you've got many false prophets 
according to the words of Jesus Christ and according to his words, many are deceived. There's no use trying to number them, just line up with what Jesus said. Ask how many false prophets have we got on hand today? Many. Well, how many people are deceived today? Many. That's that. So that's existing right now. We got false prophets all over creation. Everywhere. Look down in the valley. Many times I'm riding the highway. And I look down a past places. There's a, a village down in the valley. And I see two or three or four or five false churches. And all of them are different faiths. Look down there in the valley, there's five different faiths. And in every one of the churches is a false prophet. Saying that Jesus are being fulfilled. Many false prophets shall come. Going to rise and shall deceive many. Amen. Read the 12th verse. 24, 12. Matthew. And because iniquity shall abound. And because iniquity shall abound. The love of many, love of many is going to wax, wax cold. cold. Right. That's the truth. Because iniquity shall abound. Then that love going to get cold, getting away from the Lord. God says their sins have separated them. Love of men shall wax cold. Uh -huh. But he that shall endure unto the end. But if you will endure until the end come. Same shall be saved. The same that in do to the end. Somebody jumps in this and jump around, shout around, and have a big time and try to fast. Amen. All of it. Try to do it all in a month, two months. Glory to God. And then in this thing, you know, it doesn't backslip. Amen. <laughs> Amen. But the Bible says, He that in do it. He that endure That's right. to the end Same shall be. can't live this thing overnight. Amen. Well. Amen. You might as well look, cut down and take it gradually because you've got to do this as long as you're here. Amen. Amen. My mother used to say to me, you start what you can hold out. Amen. Amen. That was good. Start what you can hold out. Look it over. Amen. You know, you got to do something continuous all the time. You better start that thing right. Huh? Because if you don't start it right, something is going to happen. Shows your bone. And maybe you know they're always fast. Mm -hmm. Amen. Can't get them to eat. <laughs> Ain't you going to eat? No. Why? <laughs> Pointing up. Well, I know they hit it out for a ball. I know that. Because the Bible says all men must eat. You, you must eat. <laughs> Die, holy you get. Got to eat. That's right. <laughs> Amen. You got to eat. And if you don't eat, you're headed out for a fall. 
see that in do. You know, when you do a thing, that thing is not pleasant. It's not pleasant. You're just simply prepared yourself to suffer. Amen. Not pleasant. Yeah, I just didn't do such and such a thing. Amen. Now it won't be dancing and talking in tongues and amen all the way, but uh, you just have to endure it because you know it must be done. And you've got to endure the thing. That's what Jesus That's said here. Right. Jesus said, he that endure. But he that shall endure unto the end. Endure unto the end. Endure. Whatever the suffering may be, and that'll certainly be. If it isn't one thing, it's another. And if it isn't another, it's the same thing. Amen. So many times the same thing come back. It just got through with the thing and get walked in another. Now, what's your trouble? The same thing. Amen. 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 Then what are you going to have to do there? You're going to have to endure it. That's right. All right. But he that Amen. shall endure unto the end. Many times I said, all right, come on. Done, uh, done prayed for somebody, done give them good advice, and it took my time, and I'm ready to go, and my patience is is worn and all, and here I go out and here somebody just three minutes. Well, what's your trouble? And now I feel like saying, don't bother me. <laughs> but uh, I've got to endure it. Amen. Hey, man, it's not joyful. No. You bear this in mind, it's not joyful. This is the time now that I've got to do what Jesus said to here, I've got to get a hold of myself, and I've got to bring myself under, and I've got to use my patience here to possess my soul. And I've got to say now, all right, come on in. <laughs> you know what I feel like saying. Get, get, on, get out. Don't bother me. I'm not going to talk to nobody else. I'm going to hear nobody. And then I sat down to rest a while and hear long distance telephone call. Just sat down. Amen. I know it's for me when I hear the secretary say, who's calling and from where? I said, that's me. <laughs> Amen. And then they said, just a minute. I know that's me. I've got to do that. Otherwise, I say, hang up. Tell them, don't bother me. They ain't going to move. But he that endo. So much to endo that you can't do it all in two months. Can't do it all in a year. Amen. But it calls for a continual daily thing. He that endo. Whatever arise that is against us, that is unpleasant, that tries us. Yes. Amen. Whatever temptation that confronts us, we've got to endure. That's coming daily. That's coming weekly, monthly, yearly. Coming all the days of your life. He that endure. Whatever is just the opposite that is so trying so provoking, amen, so hurting, so grievous. We've got to prepare ourselves to endure it. Then if we prepare ourselves to endure it and do that, then we can look for salvation at the end. But if you don't prepare yourself to endure the hardness, that's what it is. Amen. It's hardness. When you endure, the Bible says, endure hardness. Huh? That's right. Put up with it. Yes. 
suffer it. Name yes, it. And do hardness. It isn't pleasant to endure things. It doesn't make one happy. It isn't talking and tongue and dancing. It isn't light as a feather. But you're loaded with something. But you want to be saved. And because you want to be saved, then you can do that hardness. You've got a real problem. You have a real problem. When you look down the road, it, it, it's no end to it. Amen. It's a lifetime problem. Lifetime. Now many kicks out. Many backs up. Many won't endure it. Amen. But Jesus said, he that endure to the end. Endure until the end come. Same shall be saved. Endure unto the end. Amen. Hmm. Endure it. And you've got something to endure. You got you got some. You don't tell me you get around here and won't have nothing. You you have something. Everyone, praise God, that is living godly in Christ Jesus is going to have something to endure. Yeah. But he that endure, that's right. But he that shall endure unto the end, shall endure unto the end. The end shall be saved. So start so you can keep it up. Amen. Fasting every day. <laughs> he will come. I'm going on a 40 day. Well, when you get through that 40 day, you're going back on another one. <laughs> and when you're through with that 40, you're going on another one. <laughs> and when you're through with that 40, you're going on another one. If you do, you're going to, somebody's going to soon put you where nobody will be able to see you. <laughs> Amen. Since you got to do it for life, you better take your time. Amen. Take your time so that you can keep it up. Amen. Amen. Better for me to be hungry every other day than to be hungry every day. Amen. If I get to the place I'm going to stay empty every day, I'm not going to last long. But if I be hungry every other day, and I can do much better, huh? I'm going to make a full end of things if I be hungry every day. It isn't bad to be hungry once in a while, but every day is going to call for what I won't be able to give. Amen. So I might as well start out fasting so I can keep it up until Jesus comes Amen. to the end. Amen. You can't live it in a week. Just can't do it. Devil's purpose is to deceive you, blind you, and make you soon run out. When you run out, then you're going back where you come. But he said, yeah, he that endureth. But he that shall endure unto the end. He that shall endure unto the end. Mm -hmm. Some people come in and it's too happy for me. Yeah. Too happy, love it too dear. Yeah. Amen. Oh, every time they turn, they're just talking about it. It's so wonderful and it's so sweet. And <laughs> amen, they get in the spirit. Mm -hmm. Just goes away from the, from themselves for a while. Mm -hmm. It's just so wonderful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's been long before I can't hear nothing. <laughs> but I said, when you heard from Sister So and So, almost forgot. Well, I haven't heard from her in nine months. With all of that joy, <laughs> hey, that devil is a mess. Amen. I got this, this thing must be done 
precept upon That's precept. Right. Right. Amen. Line upon line. You're preparing yourself, getting yourself ready Amen. to endure it. Amen. Getting yourself ready to endure the hardship. Whatever comes. Yeah. Bible says, endure hardness as a good soldier. Amen. Jesus Christ, endure hardness. Yeah. Amen. Prepare yourself. I'm going to take this thing gradually so that I can keep it up until I see the Lord. Yeah. That's what it calls for. Yeah. Jump in here and get baptized and get happy and see it all and shout and dance around and dance out. Yeah. Amen. Amen. I knew a woman once she got, she was always, she would get happy and oh, she just danced. And one night I sat in the pulpit and watched her. She danced all the way down the aisle to the door and went out and ain't seen her there. <laughs> Amen. But Jesus said, But he that shall endure unto But he that shall endure. Endure. To the end. Mm -hmm. Be around. Be around. Right? Just be around. Amen. Still here. That's true. Yes. Had a trial, but I'm still here. Still here. Amen. Problem, but I'm still around. Amen. Huh? Amen. But he that endures to the end. Oh, the God, the Bible said they did run well. Mm -hmm. They did run well. Oh, they run well. But who ended? I don't see him running now. <laughs> Glory to God, I can't see him running. There was a time I could see him running. <laughs> and they run well. Fasting three times a day, uh, three times a week, and three days at a time. It was too much. Too much. Right. Amen. You start to run in here, natural running. Start with all that is within you. You'll fall out. Before, if you keep that up, you'll fall out before you get three That's blocks. True. Huh? That's right. Fall out. My God, if you'll start a run that you can keep going, I'll see you running downtown. And if I go uptown, I'll see you still running. Got a little pace. Started that little pace. Because I got to run to the end. And I'm going to start so that I can still be running. Huh? Amen. That's why he said, praise God, be that running a race run off. But one received the prize. So he said, so run. Yes, yeah, so run. So run. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Start to run and so you can keep on running. That's, right. huh? that's right. Every time you see me, not running so fast, not but I'm, but, hallelujah to God, I'm right. still running. Right. Amen. You saw me the year before last, I was still running. <laughs> and you see me this year, I'm still running. And I'm running so that'll be running next year. Next year. And year after me. Right. Thank God, amen. I'm so running, so running that I can obtain the prize. That's right. Eh? That's right. Jesus said, he that it shall endure, that shall endure unto the end. Unto the end. The same shall be saved. The same shall be saved. Mm -hmm. If you'll endure to the end. Not in do halfway, two thirds of the way, but to the end. That's right. All right. But he that shall endure unto the end. But he that shall endure unto the end, the same shall be saved. The same shall be saved. The same mm -hmm. shall be saved. Now, <laughs> there's something you got to do. Don't you think you can sing this out and sing everybody happy? No. I'm dying somebody starts a song and sing everybody has it. Even the hypocrites are shouting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Amen. And they made a scope. Mm -hmm. Oh, really, God. <laughs> that isn't it. That is it. After you sing, mm -hmm. you've got to endure something. Thank God. You sang well. 
You sing you're so happy and everybody else. But after that, then it's some enduring must be done. You've got to endure something. Most people don't endure it, just won't endure it. After you sing yourself happy and everybody else and go home, there's something there waiting for you. That's right. That's right. Eh? That's right. Something waiting for you. Thank God uh, that you got to endure. Get a letter tomorrow. Thank God. That'll bring you out of that spirit. That's the truth. Bring you completely out. You'll forget to dance last night. Forget to sing. Amen. Something that you don't want to endure and something you said, I'm not going to endure. Amen. Not going to endure it. That's bad. But it told me I'm not, I, I won't endure it. I won't stand for it. I said, what you going to do? I won't do it. I'll, 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 I'll a backsliding. I won't endure it. I ain't got that bad. That bad told me. I said, what are you going to do? Amen. It was something that they should do too. Amen. You, got, you should endure everything. Even if you wasn't the cause of it, you should endure it. Bible said when you buff for your fault. So that's ticket patience. That's right. Eh? That's right. This was the, the fault of the own individual. And if it's not your fault, mm -hmm. amen, you got to endure it just like it was. You can't say, well, I didn't cause this. No, I know you didn't. Neither did Jesus. Amen. amen. He didn't cause it. We caused it. That's right. Amen. Cause it and he coming in and do it because we're something we done. That's right. And you got to get to the place that you got to end do. Praise God, something that you didn't do. You wasn't a cause of it. But you've got to end do it. You've got to end do it. Why? This cause for that. Amen. And you get to the place and on the verge of backsliding. But the Bible says, he that end do. Jesus said so. That's right. He that shall end do unto the end. Oh, Richard, God, there will be many things taken from you, many things put on you, many things you'll have to suffer. Praise God, many things you'll have to tolerate. But why am I doing it? Because I'm determined with God to be my helper, to endure unto the end. Thank God, and I shall receive a crown of glory if I endure. Eh? If I do, whatever might arise, Jesus said, he that shall endure. He, that shall endure he didn't me. say no one particular thing to endure. No, he didn't. didn't say endure the folk lying on you, and that's all, or endure them beating you, and that's all, or endure hunger, and that's all, praise God, or nakedness, and that's all. But he said, he that shall, shall endure, endure unto the end. Till the end come, whatever arise, thank God, during lifetime, during lifetime, that's what he meant, amen, whatever arise, during your lifetime, don't backslide, don't turn away, don't back up, but into it, into it. When you have endured that, something else is going to arise. Then what shall I do? Endure it. And when I'm through with that, something else is going to arise. Then what shall I do? Endure it. How long shall I endure? Until the end. And if you'll endure to the end, you got to get yourself fixed with that thing got to prepare yourself. My God, when you haven't prepared yourself, you run up on something. You say, no, I didn't think it was all of this. <laughs> no, sir. Uh -uh. I'm through. Huh? That's because you haven't prepared yourself. Amen. You started running too fast. Glory to God, you should sit down and count the cost. See how much it's going to cost. Him. Amen. Praise God. Some people are quick to get tired. And you know you've got to 
do so that you can keep on doing what you start to do. Amen. You can't do a thing too fast. No. You have to take your time to do it. And in taking your time, then you can keep on doing it. But when you start to do it too fast, you're going to fail and make a failure and get tired and going to give up. Yeah. Amen. And that's what have happened to so many. Amen. So many turn away from the joy of the Lord. Turned away from the joy of the Lord because there was something they had to endure. And because they didn't want to endure, they hadn't prepared themselves to endure. Praise God, they soon backslid and made a shipwreck. Thank God of the faith and gone on back to the world. Amen. It didn't. It isn't how well you run. Amen. It isn't that. But uh, you've got to keep on running. That's the reason the Bible tells you that all of them are running. Mm -hmm. But uh, it says to you, so run. You run so that uh, you can keep on running. And, and to do that, then you've got to prepare yourself to endure until the end. Amen. Endure until the end. And most people, when they're suffering, they're expecting it to end this week. That's right. But at least we got the next. And no longer than the last the next month. Amen. If, if, if things don't change by the last of next month, I'm going to make a change. <laughs> That's what they got in the mind. I'm going to make a change. That's true. Huh? That's true. Amen. And the devil said that before you and make it heavy. He'll make it heavy. He'll show it to you. Yes, he will. Glory to God, but his power in God. Yeah. Huh? Right. Power in God. Yeah. I don't care what it is. It's power in God. And if you get your mind on him. Amen. And says, I'm going to endure it. I shall endure it. Don't tell me that the Bible lies. The Bible says there is no temptation that taketh yet. But that which is common to man, God is faithful. Amen. Who will not suffer us to be tempted above that which we are able? Mm -hmm. eh? Filled with the temptation. Also make, also make a way to escape, to escape that we able will be able to bear it. Glory to God. Huh? Yes. Amen. I say we'll be able. Oh, it's trying, some. It's trying, but we'll be able. God is faith. Thank God. That's right. God is faith. Yes. And if you just keep your eyes on God mm -hmm. and watch Him. Uh, regardless of the, uh, the temptation of the suffering or whatever may be, watch God. Mm -hmm. Don't tell me. You can't tell that to me. You'll have to tell that to somebody else. Amen. The reason you can't tell it to me because I have a knowledge, a little knowledge of this thing here. Mm -hmm. Thank God that it's a way mm -hmm. to escape. That's right. That God is safe. Wherefore, let him that thinketh he stand. Amen. When you think, you stand it. Take heed. Take heed. Lest he fall. Lest he fall. They have no temptation. They had no temptation. Glory to God. No temptation. Okay. How sick you are. How sick you've been. How sick you can be. How the pains are cutting and cracking. Thank God, but keep your eyes. On God. Eh? Keep your eyes on God. For it says here what? They have no temptation. They have no temptation. No temptation. Eh? Taking you. Taking you. But such. But such as is common, common to, man. to man. But God is faithful. Somebody, thank God, has had that same temptation. I said, somebody had it. Thank God. Somebody had it. Somebody sailed. That, that poet told me. Through bloody sea. Bloody sea. Somebody had it. Glory to God before you. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's All right. They have no temptation. No temptation. Taking you. Taking you. But such as, but a, common such as a common to man. But God is faithful. But God is faithful. Who will not suffer? Who will not tempted. suffer? He sees it. He knows that. He know what you're going through. 
He's looking at you. Yeah. He knows all about us. He's watching things. He won't suffer you. They go above that. With your Aren't able. you able? But we'll it's you. trying. But it's not you able. Yeah. It's testing. But you able. Thank God is grievous. Yeah. But you able. Oh, Somebody else went on. Yeah. You keep going. Yeah. Thank God is coming to man. Yeah. Hallelujah to God. Amen. God is faithful. Right. Somebody else had it. I yeah. said somebody yeah. is going on. Yes. Yeah. Amen. It says it's common. Common to man. It's a common thing. That's right. Another huh? thing. It's a common thing. That's right. I lost all I had, but it's a common thing. That's right. Seek every day, but it's a common thing. Somebody else is sick. Somebody else is yes. sick. Yes, sir. Somebody else went on. Yes, sir. Pain in day and night. Thank God, but it's Somebody common else. to me. Yes, Somebody else has endured it yes. and kept the eyes on God. Yes. Hallelujah. God ain't waited until the change for the change. Yes. Huh? Yes. Don't tell I wait. All the days of my appointed time. I'm going to wait till that change comes. Going to stay right here. I don't want to be moved. I'm not going to make the change. I'm going to wait for it to come. Hang on. Bible tells me it's common to man. They have no temptation. No temptation. Taking you. Glory to God. No. no. Taking you. But such as is common but to such man. Such as common to man. But God is God is faithful. Who will not suffer you to who be tempted? Who will not suffer you to be tempted? Above that you are able. Above that you are able. But will with the temptation. Look out! Look! Look for the escape. Yes. Look for it. If you believe God, yes. if you believe God, you look for the escape. Yes. Huh? Yes. Oh, it's a God said God. But God is faithful. But God is faithful. Who will not suffer you to be tempted? Amen. Amen. The Bible says, let the brother of low degree rejoice. Yes. Huh? That is exalted. Rejoice. Why? He's exalted. He's going to be taken out, taken from that low degree, and going to be exalted. And if you believe God, if you believe this, That's right. regardless of the suffering, Thank God you said, I, I, I'm looking. Thank God to be exalted. I'm looking. They come out of it. Yes. I'm going to shake it off. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm going to get to be said. Thank God he will not suffer me to be tempted. Up all that. Yes. Thank God that I'm able. But with the temptation, I'll wait till the peace comes. I God to be called. He's going to make a way for me to escape. I'm coming out of it. God said so. Because he's faithful. Hallelujah to God. He's faithful. God is faithful. In your suffering. God is faithful. In your time. God is faithful. Who will not suffer you to be faithful? As you believe God. I said to believe God. They got answer. Thank God to the top. As they believe God, the Bible is telling us that, yes. that He is faith. God is faith. That God is faith. Yes, He is. He, God. God. Is faith. he knows what you're going through. Yes, he is faith. Thank God. He's watching over you. He wants to suffer you to be tempted above that. That you able. Thank God for that. But what? But God is faithful. But God. Holy yes. to God. Yes, sir. Eh? Yes, sir. Amen. You know, if you're waiting on somebody to do something for you, that is faith. Yes. Hallelujah to God. Yes, <laughs> is my time gone? <laughs> 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 Waiting on someone. That is faithful. And I just wait. Thank God I just stay there. God. God. Is faithful. 
who will not suffer you to be tempted above that which you are able, but will thank God this is heaven. Get my way. Yes. Yes. That's in my view. Thank God. Thank God.